वेलकम बैक स्टूडेंट्स सो दिस क्वेश्चन इज फ्रॉम गेट 2016 एग्जाम सेट टू सो लेट अस हैव अ लुक एट द क्वेश्चन देन वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व इट लेट एक्स वन एक्स और एक्स टू एक्स और एक्स थ्री एक्स और एक्स फोर इज इक्वल टू जीरो वेयर एक्स वन एक्स टू एक्स थ्री एक्स फोर आर बुलियन वेरिएबल्स एंड द सिंबल इज द एक्स और ऑपरेटर विच वन ऑफ द फॉलोइंग मस्ट ऑलवेज बी ट्रू so just have a look at these four options okay so they are asking if this equation is valid in that case out of these four which uh, equation will always be true okay first of all let's find out under what conditions will this equation be valid now here we have multiple inputs and we are taking their xor how many inputs do we have 1 2 3 4 so these are the four inputs of xor okay you can see xor outputs high whenever odd number of inputs are high okay say three of these are high in that case output will be one or only one of them only one of x1 x2 x3 x4 is high so the output will also be high but in this case we want the output to be low so for output to be low the condition is even number of inputs should be high that means either zero input is high or two inputs are high or all the four inputs are high only in these conditions the output is going to be low what do i mean by saying this let's consider this one if two inputs are high that means say x2 and x3 are one we we can be very sure that output is going to be low okay these two are zeros these two are ones the output will be zero this is the condition for low output in xor okay let's write down these uh, inputs so if zero inputs are high that means all are low okay and uh, if four inputs are high that means all are high okay so four input four inputs high means all ones and two inputs high means there could be multiple cases uh, there will be four c two such cases let me write all of them so you can see we have written all the conditions when this equation could be true they are saying assume it to be true okay they are saying let this that means this one is true which implies x1 x2 x3 x4 can take these possible values that's it okay so out of 16 combinations of inputs we have narrowed down to these inputs only now we need to find out which one of these will always be true okay let's do one thing let's try to find out which which one of these will be false under some condition okay so if you want to prove this one false it will be false only under one case when all x1 x2 x3 x4 are high surely their and will also be one so this uh, option a will be false under the condition x1 x2 x3 x4 all are one and you can see such a input is allowed okay they are saying this is true this is true means such a input is possible so under this condition option a fails we need to determine which of the following is always true this word always needs special attention okay it's possible that option a would be correct for this one this one this one this one this one this one and this one but what about this one case it fails here so this one could not be your answer so option d seems easy one it is x1 plus x2 plus x3 plus x4 is equal to 
if even one of these inputs is high okay this is uh, or okay we are taking or of four inputs even if one of them is high any one the output will be one okay that means for all these cases option d will fail okay so this one is also not possible now let's analyze this one this one is also easy you can just see when x2 is high the output will be one that means this option b will be proved wrong when x2 is high okay let's see if this equation ever allows value of x2 to be one yeah it's here so let me just uh, mark the conditions i've lost my marker anyways let's use the blue one so this uh, option b would fail under two conditions first one is if x2 is high then this uh, equation will be proved wrong wherever x2 is high just mark those this one this one this one this one and that's it there's one more condition whenever x1 and x3 are high both of them are high in that case also this option b would be proved wrong so 1 and 3 1 and 3 so this condition okay the thing is we have found at least one input where option b fails so this one cannot be the answer okay so the only possible answer is option c this has to be correct anyways still let's prove it is correct you can just check it for all the inputs that uh, this one will not fail ever for all these inputs but still i'll prove it in uh, other way uh, let's not erase these so i'm writing here you can see x1 bar xor x3 bar can be written as x1 xor x3 okay how can i say that let us solve this lhs of this equation it is x1 xor x3 okay x1 bar xor x3 so you expand this xor you will get x1 bar x1 bars bar x3 bar plus x3 bars bar x1 bar so this is x1 x3 bar plus x3 x1 bar you can see this is the equation for x1 xor x3 that means if you have a bar on both the inputs of xor the bars could be neglected the output still remains unaffected so this could be written like this also this rhs can be written as x2 xor x4 now you see we are saying out of these out of these four either you could have uh, zero inputs that are high that means all inputs are low basically this case okay you see for both of them uh, for uh, 0x or 0 it will be 0 and 0x or 0 it will also be 0 so this case is taken care of then next case is all the inputs are one okay so we have both the inputs same so when xor's inputs are same the output is zero this will output a zero and one xor one this will output a zero okay in this case also it's valid this one is done now the third possibility is when any two of these are high okay so any two of these are high is possible in many cases suppose 
द टू इनपुट्स विच आर हाई आर एक्स वन एंड एक्स थ्री सो बोथ ऑफ देम आर सेम सेम वेन इनपुट्स ऑफ एक्स आर आर सेम आउटपुट इज जीरो ओके हेयर ऑल्सो इफ बोथ ऑफ देम आर हाई देन बोथ ऑफ देम हैव टू बी लो ओके बिकॉज ओनली टू इनपुट्स आर हाई वी आर कंसिडरिंग दीज केसेज नाउ वेन ओनली टू इनपुट्स आर हाई इफ बोथ ऑफ देम आर हाई बोथ ऑफ देम विल बी लो ओके सो आउटपुट ऑफ दिस विल ऑल्सो बी जीरो सेकेंड केस इज बोथ ऑफ देम आर लो सो बोथ ऑफ देम विल बी हाई इट्स द सेम केस थर्ड केस इज वन ऑफ देम इज लो एंड वन ऑफ देम इज लो ओके सो द टू इनपुट्स दैट आर हाई वन ऑफ देम इज ऑन दिस साइड एंड वन ऑफ देम इज ऑन दिस साइड दिस मीन्स वन एक्स और जीरो दैट इज वन एंड वन एक्स और जीरो दैट इज ऑल्सो वन सो वी हैव सीन फॉर ऑल दीज केसेज ऑल्सो This option C is valid. So your answer is option C. Okay.